Hey guys, so obviously they also did unveil um, this new smartphone that is like Android phone that was made for it because they have like four or three virtual buttons. Uh, so I'm not sure if it's, how it's, uh, Android phone is going to be on a Samsung Galaxy S2 or another phone. Uh, if uh, I mean, uh, okay, so you're going to have like three virtual buttons and then you're going to have like three rear buttons. Android phone is going to look like really weird on a non a non uh, Galaxy Nexus phone maybe they could you know remove that at the bottom or something but you're not going to get that like real experience um, but seriously sexy phone uh, 4.65 inch uh, Super AMOLED display uh, but I'm not sure I mean uh, it's a Super AMOLED display 12 8 on 720 but it, it's not like a Super AMOLED plus uh, does that mean that Samsung Galaxy S2 have a better display? And also, one thing, the camera 5 megapixel, but the Galaxy S2 have 8 megapixel. I'm not sure if uh, this one have better or if it's the same, uh, but it sure doesn't look like the same. But this is 1080p, uh, 30 frames per second video recording, but still, it's the display not as good as the Galaxy S2. That feels kind of weird. Uh, and then it's the little bigger battery, uh, 1750 milliamps, comparing to the Galaxy S2 that have 1600 something. Um, so, I mean, I was really hoping for like 2000 something because the screen is much bigger. Um, maybe one of the reasons why they didn't go with the plus screen uh, is because it takes up more, 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 more memory or more battery. Uh, they also unveiled two versions of it, an HBA Plus version that's extremely good speeds and also like they're gonna have like a 4G version um, or, or LTE tablet version and that's better than HBA Plus but still both are pretty good and awesome if you live in one of those places where they have those things. Um, so pretty good I'm saying uh, 1632 gigabytes, 1 gigabytes of RAM, uh, kind of same processor or I think the processor also is even worse than the Galaxy S2, 1.2 gigahertz a dual core processor um, but this is something that we usually I think we see with Nexus phones that they don't usually have the the best uh, you know text tech thingies but they do have some cool things like this uh, they're like it have this NFC technology so it will be able to make Android beam to send quickly things over to the other phone uh, and seriously I, w I want this phone um, and everything it's it's insane so um, are you looking forward, uh, forward to a new phone I think this is a badass phone it's sexy ass I want it right now because it looks so much better than mine uh, with the biggest screen 4.65 that's badass the camera on the back it's badass and they also made like uh, the back they made some, like in a better material or something or it's the same materials but it's some kind of better or something they said to us and it just looks more you know clean so really I can has right now I want this device 4G version no, we, we don't even have 4G here. Or maybe we have 4G. Maybe I can get 4G speeds with this. Um, but still, badass phone. Are you going to pick it up? Or are you going to wait for another phone? Um, because this is probably going to be the last uh, big phone. Uh, at least this year coming with Android 4.0. Do you think it looks badass? I think it looks badass. And it's going to come out in November. November in both Europe and the US. Uh, I'm not sure about those other countries, but maybe launched in another country as well. But seriously, I do love that uh, on the top that Google search it looks so clean and everything. Seriously, Google, take my money. I want this phone right now. What about you? It's going to be the iPhone 4S or Galaxy Nexus. I'm not sure. 